Hello, my name is Abdekrim Achten Sheikh Mahmoud and this is the Explainer. Hello, we will explain why our Prime Minister, His Excellency Mohammed Hussein Roble, saved Somalia, Somalia's elections. It started in July 2020 when the Dusmrab meeting was held in the same city. The intention was to reach a compromise on an electoral model for the parliamentary elections in December 2020 and the presidential elections on 8 February 2021. Then, on 17 September 2020, the government, of, of the, the government and federal states reached an agreement on the election model that is roughly the same as that of 2017 and 2012. But it is not good as they, as they accepted, expected. The two federal states of Puntland and Jubaland ignored the agreement and accused Villa Somalia of abusing the elections to, ex to execute a term extension of office for former President Mohammed Abdullahi Mohammed. Then something terrible happened. After Farmajo passed a two year term extension in Parliament, the opposition decided to send their militias to Mogadishu and attempt to overthrow Farmajo. But Alhamdulillah, they did not succeed in bringing a part two to the civil war. Prime Minister Mohammed Hussein Roble told opposition to stop this war and in May 2021 he organized a meeting between the opposition and members of the government, including Villa Somalia. And then, after almost a year of political infighting and chaos, the election finally starts. First of all, in July 2021, the Senate elections were held. They lasted until about September. Then the lower house had to come. But it was delayed because former NISA agent Fahad Yassin Hatijahir tried to get a seat from the Hub 86. And the critic of Yassin was murdered in the Beledwain by unknown men, presumably from Al Shabaab. And now the presidential elections. After nearly a year, Roble managed to complete the low house elections and elect a parliament speaker on 27 April 2022. That was former speaker Adam Nur Mudebe. Then we were ready for the presidential elections on May 15. Opposition members such as Hassan Sheikh Mahmoud, Sheikh Sharif Sheikh Ahmed, and the Sheikh Kurva Sama, and the current president Dan Farmajo campaign to persuade the MPs to vote for them. The 15 May elections were very corrupt and Qatar as well as UAE and Kenya were accused of bribing MPs. When the new president became Hassan Sheikh Mahmoud, Farmaj decided to give up and accept his de defeat with these words. <laughs> And when he was inaugurated as the 10th president of Somalia, Mohammed Abdullah and Mohammed Farmajo went from, a f went from Villa Somalia to his Persaid's villa in south of Mogadishu. We are happy that our Prime Minister, His Excellency Mohammed Hussein Roble, saved Somalia from a part two to the civil war and to authoritarian dictatorship. He deserves a Nobel Peace Prize. This was Abdekrim Achten Sheikh Mahmoud from Dalek Explaining Dalek Predictions. Bye!